More than LinkedIn, new shave every day. How y'all doing today? Hopefully you're doing pretty good, because I'm doing pretty good too. Now, got a lot in this one. But yeah, before we get started, I noticed my last couple videos, I actually, sometimes I mess up when I say something, or sometimes I, ah, I didn't come out wrong type thing. I'm just learning to do the text on here, so I'm gonna have to, <laughs> this is gonna be the start of this video. I'm gonna start watching it and figuring out where I mess up at and putting the text on there just because I'm a human. So if I make a 30 minute video or 40 minute video, I'm re-watching a 40 minute video. So <laughs> it's not just you watching it that long. Anyways, so today we're going to be doing kind of like a purple kind of theme and you're like, what? Why? Well, I'll show you in a second, but first purple, wearing this, is actual skull. And it's got boom boxes and cassette tapes. These are real boom boxes. They're not just a fake drawn one. These are actual real from the 80s. Now this shirt's called Solar Flare. And when the sun hits it, it actually brings out all this color. This comes in like this color, the color comes out. You can't use heat and you can't use like a flashlight. It's only activated by the UV light and the sun. So pretty cool. I have a Patrick Kane uh, Hockey Fights Cancer uh, purple jersey. I don't really feel like wearing a hockey jersey today though, so yeah. And we're still going with purple. What do you mean purple? Well, purple as well. You can see what time it is. XLG Shock Series, purple and blue. Watch. 6.40, Monday. <laughs> this is the XL Series 5146 GA-110 HC-1A, so. These are no longer available anymore. I think you can only get these like maybe off of eBay or maybe off of Amazon or something. So yeah, anyway, purple. We're going purple. What, what are we going with this purple? Anyway, I'll explain in a second. The eraser we're going to be using today is 1965 Gillette, Lady Gillette K2 Champagne Gold. Lady Gillette. Yep, and there's a reason why I'm using this particular razor today, so I'll explain in a second. But this is mine. You can see the little patina marks in there, the green. I'm not gonna fix it, I'm gonna leave it just the way it is. It's in good shape, I got this from Florida, so 35 bucks I think with shipping and uh, free shipping, so. Something from Florida, that's in pretty good shape from Florida. So, the DE razor we're gonna be using today. DE blade we're going to be using today is Gillette Platinum, first use, brand new, right out of the package. I already threw the package away. And this is the actual one from Russia. Now, I got this package out of my Gillette Heritage book package, so that's the one we're using today. This is from the Gillette's Gillette Heritage, you can see on the back. So this is the Russian one. Now, the reason why I'm using this today is as I, I just watched a video from She Shaves with Jill, and she's actually given one of these away, but it's not just any particular one like this. It's from a Justin from a company called Sherlock Razor Company, and it is a 1962 Lady Gillette H4 Wonder Woman. What? What do you mean Wonder Woman? Well, it's a heat painted. He had it heat painted and this part's gold. This part's gold and just the doors are like a dark red and the stars are like a white. And then this part's like a dark blue and this part is gold, like Wonder Woman. Who didn't like Wonder Who didn't like Linda Carter, Linda Carter in the 80s? Dark hair and blue eyes. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. I actually had when I was a kid, long time ago in the 80s. You guys remember the, remember the TV show Fall Guy? Lee Majors? I had a crush on Heather Thomas, man. <laughs> I was like, oh, dun, 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 dun. <laughs> blonde hair. <sighs> yeah. Anyway, yeah, that's what we're rocking today. So if you go to her website, or her website, if you go to her face, dude, if you go to her YouTube channel and you're a subscriber, I think, you can enter down below say thanks Justin you could be entered into win a Wonder Woman DE razor from Sherlock razor company I rock the heck out of that razor if I want it ain't gonna shame my game I use it <laughs> so yeah that's what we're doing today now get my coffee my cup now this is a 20 ounce this is what I drink on the on the weekends I drink three of these a 20 ounce cup I got from Spencer's Gifts in the mall. And I'll put like this much creamer, two fingers, one finger, one and a half. And 
creamer I got today is Coffee Mate Snickers. So, this is my second cup. Coffee I am. No sponsor here. I picked this up yesterday. Starbucks Fall Blend. Limited edition. Just purchased this yesterday, so that's what we're using today. All right, here we go. So, purple, huh? What, what's with the purple, dude? Well, we're actually going to be using a shaving cream today. Really? Yeah, we're going to be using a shaving cream. Not a soap, not a puck, not a hard soap, a shaving cream. And it is from Taylor of Old Bond Street Lavender Shaving Cream. That's what we're using today. My, it's kind of faded. It was like pretty bright purple or lavender color. I don't know what happened, but yeah. So that's what we're using today. Oh yeah, very nice lavendery color. See, see what we're going with the purple lavender today? Yeah, this is the only shaving cream soap I actually have that's an actual color. The other, I think the only one other one I have is the Phoenix Artist and Accoutrements Crown King um, uh, a lump of coal that's black, but this is purple, so that's why we're doing all purple kind of stuff, purple kind of thing today. So, for the soap, shaving cream, real, real, real soft. Everybody knows this stuff, and a nice sheen to it, but nice, calming, lavendery scent. So, that's what we're doing today. Brush we're going to be using today is I picked this up from West Coast Shaving, Southern California, and is is the Yaki Professional 24 millimeter. Not written down. <laughs> Yaki Carvel 24 millimeter Arctic synthetic brush. <clears throat> brush, excuse me. It's got the little swirl in there. Kind of like the purple haze one. Mew, was it Mew Brown? I want to get that purple haze one someday, but <laughs> I'm saving for the Big Shapes West, so <laughs> gotta save my nickels. <laughs> save my nickels and dimes, man. So it's got the gray top and white hair. And yeah, that's the reason today. Now, I already have a little bit in my bowl and these are little sticky things like like kind of like how the bottom of well let's appreciate reason today kind of like how the bottom of this I forgot where I got them from but I actually just put those in there and stuck them down give them more traction and stuff <laughs> so yeah that's what we're using today let's get this Started with a pre-shave. The water should be heated up. It is like 42 degrees here, so, and it's only 6:46 a.m. But it's nice. I like the cold weather here in Arizona. Oh, this was just hot. Mm. <sighs> Come on. There. Just had that heated up. Oh well. Oh well. All right. So don't knock over my cup. Today we're using one point on the shower. Being sorry, Mr. Coochman's Mentholate Appreciate Cube 2.0 with the old doc as a pre-shave. Yeah. <laughs> so, got that on there. Got that on there. Wash you the hand. Boom. I'm going to try something today. I'm going to try something a little bit different. Now, I don't actually... I know some people, some people load it in there. I'm not gonna, I don't personally want to put the water and put it in there in a cream and then make it all gooey. I think, I haven't done it, but I usually just scoop it and put it in there. But I'm gonna try doing it this way today, upside down, wet the brush and just get the tips of the brush with a little bit of product in there because I don't want to throw some water up in there and potentially ruin the soap. Maybe it might not, but. Anyway, that brush in there. 
and a block on the finger. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Shakes. <laughs> Alright, let's try this. Just get the tips. Get a little bit of product on there, so. I just don't want to throw any water up in the puck itself. So. Yeah. There. That should be good, right? Yeah. Hopefully. I haven't used this stuff in a while, so. Oh. Getting ahead of myself. I'm still going to put some glycerin in the bowl. A little bit. Hopefully I don't mess up it up. Hopefully that doesn't mess it up. But, yeah. I'll put a little, little bit of water in there. Because I have it on the side too, so. Let's go. Just get that all in there and swirl it up. Swirl it up. Yeah. Yeah, I haven't used this stuff in a while, but nice lavendery scent. Now to me, well, truth be told, I actually used to have tattoos. <laughs> I actually got all my tattoos lasered off like years ago. And won't get into the reason why. It's not I didn't have any like gang tattoos or anything like that. It's just kind of a personal thing. And yeah, I had them all lasered off. Now when I did have them though, when I did have tattoos, um, when you go to a tattoo parlor, they tell you, they tell you that uh, a little more water. Um, after you get it done, they give you something called tattoo goo, and it's specifically made for tattoos. It brings the color out, it helps it heal, and it gives your tattoo a vibrant color. One of the things they told me is don't ever use Neosporin. You don't want to use Neosporin on your tattoo because it'll ruin it. It'll fade it, and it's just not good for your tattoo, so... Come from a tattoo bar, like I kind of, you know, I kind of take their word and trust it. Now you're talking about tattoos, Chris. Where the hell are you going with this? Well, to me, when I first smelled, this smells like tattoo goo to me. I mean, that was years and years and years and years ago. So, but still, that scent memory. I'm like, wow, tattoo goo. It's a good scent. So, I don't know if they have that outside of the states. I know they have tattoo goo in the states. So. I don't know if they have it overseas or anything, or if it's just like an American thing. But if you guys know what it is, or you've smelt that before, or yeah, so yeah, awesome. Get that going today. Nice cream. <laughs> more there. Get that scrapey there. A little bit more water. Seems like it needs. The cream needs a little bit more water than like a so there, than a soap. So I actually thought about editing this part out, doing this, but I'm gonna leave it in, just cause kind of something I'm learning, and you know, you get to watch me learn at the same time. It's kind of cool. You don't like it? You can fast forward to the part where we're shaving or whatever. But you're gonna miss what I'm gonna say right now. <gasps> Is it important? Well, kind of. I'm still working on my 100 subscriber appreciation giveaway. Didn't forget about that. Just take, <laughs> give me time, man, give me time. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, that's a food. Magnifique. That's good. Nice, good, good. All right, I think we're good. So, yeah, still working on that. I just got to putting it together. So, give me time. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Very nice. Very good. Oh, yeah. Nice thick. We all know TOBS, right? I guess that's what they, that's the abbreviation for it, TOBS. Taylor Will Bond Street, TOBS. TOBS is using today, man. Oh, what TOBS are you using today? <laughs> oh, the lavender one there, the lavender one there, mate. All right, chap. I don't know. I can't do, I can't do that. Accent very well. <laughs> Yeah, 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 look at that. Ooh. Calming. Oh, let's go to sleep. <laughs> Keep calm and shave. Very nice. Yeah, we're good. Water's dripping down on there. 
Maybe I put too much water. <laughs> that guy Chris, he's kind of known for that, right? Too much, too much water on stuff. Anyway, heat the razor up. Heat that lady up, man. Good to go. Allen block on my fingers. Get a good grip. Boom, here we go. Long handle. If you're a big dude, perfect. Super speed head. Mild. Nice. Now, this particular blade, this Chillette Platinum, I would put it on, hang on. Oh yeah, very good, very, very good. I would put it on a scale, I would compare it on a scale of one to five, one being the mildest and one being the sharpest, most aggressiveness. I would put that lit I would put that blade at maybe a 4.5 right up there like pretty neck and neck with a Kai blade not as sharp as a feather but almost so it's pretty sharp blade so if you like them blades that's what I put it at as Oh, very nice. <laughs> she's a lady. Whoa, whoa, whoa. She's a lady. And the lady is mine. <laughs> Tom Jones. Hold it. Well, you're me. Been a musician since I was about 15 years old. I'm 41 now, so when I get into something, I get into it. Well, boom, I'm into it. What the heck did I get into? I study it though, I do the history on everything. Look at that, very nice. Problem area, all right. Pre-shave cube, <laughs> pre-shave cube, good. Taylor Road Bond Street, good. T razor, good. Blade, very nice. Yeah. Very good. Oh, I did whip. I did get me. Man, spoke too soon. Very nice, very, very nice. Yeah, about a four point about a four point five. That's where I would personally put it at. Wipe this up a little bit. Just rub it in there. Not gonna completely clear it off or clean it. We'll just rub it in. So we can get past two. Ah, oh, it's getting a little bit cold. Oh well. <laughs> Microwave. Alright, here we go. A little bit off there. Well, swirly it up a bit. Yeah, nice scent. Nice lavender scent. Very good. Out of 4.5 though, yeah. Pretty sharp blade. 
Yeah, nice thick leather. Ooh. Yeah, all right, here we go. Get the blade, and we're going for pass number. doing a three pass today so two's good <laughs> you don't chase the bbs the bbs the bbs chases you remember that flip I did get spoke too soon. That's my problem spot. I need to look at it closely. Like, um, maybe there's like a bump there, or maybe the skin's different or something there. That's my, I get myself more there than anywhere else on my entire neck. I mean, look, here's fine. Just maybe it's different. I don't know hairs map differently or just that's a spot i don't get it so yeah all right i think we're good though so that's my my problem area it's crazy because that's where you feel your heartbeat and stuff so you can't your own you can't feel your own heartbeat somebody else has to do it for you oh no you can what am i talking about duh you can't use your thumb that's what i mean you have to use these two fingers feel your heart You can't do the thumb. I think it's the thumb. I think it's the thumb. Yeah. What are we doing? <laughs> All right. Clean up in the shower and be right back. Ramble on. Okay, I'm back. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Except for you. My problem area. Still, still, still leaking there a little bit. My vampire bite. <laughs> Yeah. Otherwise, yeah, very good. Smooth. Pretty much BVS for me. Yeah, very good shape. Very good shape beside that spot. But we're gonna try fixing that real quick. So, PA on block with no slip. Got your kung fu grip. Yes, I know that's Bruce Lee. And Sting. Come Sting. Yeah, stings a little bit. Rest? No, close, very close. That blade's very close. Like I said, about a 4.5 on a one to scale, one to five scale on mild to aggressive, efficient. You're still bleeding, aren't you? Hey, we don't have time for this little neck. <laughs> Stop bleeding. Knock it off. Don't do it. Okay. Pat dry. It's probably still gonna keep leaking, but oh well. It is what it is. Aftershave we're going to be using today. From the Fine Accoutrements Classic Aftershave La Orange Noir. Oh. 
Mr. Fine Splash. Feels great, smells great. <laughs> so, we're using today. Very nice orangey scent. Oh yeah. Whew, yeah. Good, 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 good scent. Very manly. Manly. Yeah. A little bit. Okay. No sting, really. Hmm. Just hold it on there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My new thing. I want to smell it. I want to smell it all day. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, very nice. I actually picked this up and this up from. Phoenix Arts and Accoutrements, so that's where I got it from. All right, still weeping? A little bit. Knock it off. <laughs> Boom, that's it. So, let's wash the hands a little bit. Yeah. Get another drink. With the lights out, it's less dangerous. No, that's not the only Nirvana song. All right. So, recap of what we used today. It's blood. That's what we used today. A lot of it. Oh, well, not a lot. Just kidding. Blood. Bloody mist. Fine accoutrements. La Orange Noir aftershave. Very good. Yeah, I smell it through the glass. <laughs> Wonder Woman's. You guys remember Wonder Woman's, uh, what, the cartoon? Her, uh, her airplane was clear. I thought that was weird. Did you see her like flying through the air? <laughs> it's a cartoon, but you can still see the outline of the ship. You guys know that, right? Remember the cartoon? Marvel? Is it Marvel? DC? Marvel, DC. Oh, figured out. Coffee's hitting me. <laughs> anyway, Phoenix Artists and Accoutrements Allen Block comes with the rubber band and a, and a case. That's what we use today. DE razor we used today is 1965 Lady Gillette K2 with Gillette Platinum first use from the Heritage Gillette Heritage razor. This was the blades that it came with. This is the Russian one, so this is what we used today. <coughs> shaving cream we used today, Taylor of Old Bond Street Lavender Shaving Cream Court Hairdressers. That's why we're doing all purple today. Lavender. Brush we use today, what I got from West Coast Shaving. Yaki, I got it written down. <laughs> Yaki Carvel 24mm Arctic Synthetic Brush. This thing's cool. I like this thing a lot. I love this swirly stuff in there. If you have this, you you know what I'm talking about. But I want to get the Purple Haze one someday, but saving for Big Shaves West. Pre shave we use today. King Stars and Accoutrements 2.0. I'm going to put it in the shower. 2.0 appreciate mentholated cube on the old dock. Yeah. Did I mention that Big Shaves West coming up? <laughs> See y'all there. <laughs> Hopefully I'll make it. Be cool. <laughs> make it bigger than last year. <sighs> and it'll be cooler too. Last year was hot. It was in April. And this year is going to be March 28th. So it should be cooler. So it'll be, it'll be good. Da -da. It'll be good. So. Yeah, that's it. Check out uh, Shades with She Shades with Jill. Her last video she did. If you want to win, yeah, subscribe to her. <laughs> Give her a subscription too. Don't just oh I want to fruit something free and then unsubscribe. That's rude. Keep going. So stop bleeding. <laughs> all right, ladies and gents. Hope y'all have to have a good day. Have a good week. Have good shaves. And. I will see you guys very soon. I am still working on that 100 subscriber video, I promise. It's not like I'm doing this video now and be like, oh, I forgot about it. No, I'm still working on it, but I just want to do it right. So thank you all very much, too. <laughs> you guys rock. Peace.